up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lindsay, and in today's video, we are going to be doing my Bath & Body Works candle collection. I just sat down and organized all of my candles from Bath & Body Works, and I counted around 56 that's right, 56 different candles from Bath & Body Works. Some are repeats because I love repurchasing my favorite candles, but I roughly have around 50 different scents from Bath & Body Works, ranging from fruity to fall to food and everything in between. So if you're interested in what candles I have in my collection from Bath & Body Works, what are my favorites, what are misses, what I repurchase time and time again, and what I would pass on, please just keep on watching. So just a little disclaimer, I have been purchasing these candles for over like three years now and I almost always get these candles on sale. I never buy them full price. Bath & Body Works always has sales going on, either $10 candles, $10 off their candles, buy two, get two, whatever it is, they always have a sale. So I never get these full price and I have been buying them for a long period of time. So I didn't just go out to Bath & Body Works and buy 56 candles in one go about. That would be insane and so expensive. So I've been hoarding these underneath my bed. Ask Josh. We have a ongoing collection of candles and boxes under our bed and we rotate them out every so often so that is my little disclaimer on that so going forward I have broken the candles down into different categories just to make it a little bit easier on this video and have it have some sort of structure instead of just spewing out different scents and all that so So the first category I'm going to share with you guys today is my summer scent collection. These are the candles that I recently just purchased from Bath & Body Works. They're their summer scents and limited edition scents that they come out with for the summertime. Some are limited to the 2021 season and some they bring back every summer. So the first summer scent that I recently just picked up, I haven't burned yet. Most of these I haven't burned yet because that would be insane trying to burn them all. So I don't know their lasting power, how strong they are, but usually Bath & Body Works candles are very strong. They last a super long time like I have had this candle that we have burning in a room for about two months now and it has yet to finish so they do last a long time and they smell the entire house that sounds weird but they do go throughout the entire house and I think they are some of the best candles out there so, so the first scent I'm gonna share with you guys from Bath & Body Works in the summer category is hibiscus paradise this is a new one that I just purchased about last week and it just smells so good the notes in this one are pink hibiscus Juicy Guava, Sunkissed Coconut, and Essential Oils. And honestly, it kind of just smells like a yummy suntan lotion. It just smells like summer. It smells so good and I can't wait to burn it. And also, it's so cute, like this rose gold packaging. It looks amazing, so I'm super excited to burn this candle. The next in the summer category is Kiwi Starfruit Cooler. Josh actually picked this one out. And the notes in this one are sweet starfruit, sparkling kiwi seltzer, splash of guava juice, lemon garnish with natural essential oils. Very cute. But this one just smells very like kiwi forward. So if you like kiwi, definitely recommend this one. If you're not a kiwi fan, probably steer clear from it. But it honestly smells like that drink from Starbucks, that kiwi starfruit one. So if you like that and you like the smell of it, I definitely recommend this. But just a very nice, very cute scent for the summertime. So recommend this one as well. Next for the summer category, we have warm ocean breeze. And the notes in this one are ocean sandalwood, warm sage, eucalyptus, eucalyptus, yeah, eucalyptus zest, coconut, and essential oils. And this one kind of smells to me personally like a mix between a spa and a men's cologne. If you know what I'm talking about, it just has like, I don't know, it smells like Josh's deodorant almost, which I love because I love the smell of his deodorant and it reminds me of him. So if you like like a manly smelling candle, I definitely recommend this one, but it still has like that summer vibe to it with the coconut in it. So I absolutely love this candle and I cannot wait to burn it. It's a very like manly scent. So if your boyfriend doesn't like you burning like fruity girly candles, like Josh really doesn't care, he loves them. But if you're in that situation, I definitely recommend this one. It's more of like a manly scent. Next we have this one and it is my only floral scented candle in my collection. I'm just not a fan of floral scents. I just think they smell like grandma's I don't know I just don't like the scent of like flowers in a candle it's just not my vibe but this one is called sundress and the notes in this one are crisp pear sparkling white wine fresh apples and white oak and I really don't get any of those scents in this candle I'm like pretty sick right now so honestly it's kind of hard to smell these but I what I remember when I purchased this candle I purchased this online so I didn't get a chance to smell it in person but 
it's very floral and I don't know it just isn't my favorite I mean it's very cute I love the packaging it's like very girly and cute but not my favorite I think this was limited edition and I don't even think they have it on their website anymore but it's a nice scent and who knows maybe I'll burn it one day or I can always re-gift it I love gifting candles to people if I don't like them or I think someone else would like it like I feel like my cousin would like this or even my grandma like this is like a good scent it's just not up my alley the next candle we have is juicy pink grapefruit this is another limited edition one that I just barely picked up but the scents in this one as you could guess is sugared pink grapefruit juicy pear fresh mango blossoms with natural essential oils and this one smells heavenly I just love the smell of grapefruit I love everything about it it just smells so good I don't like eating grapefruit I think it's like sour and disgusting but the smell of like pink grapefruit is amazing to me and this one just smells so fruity and delicious and that signature grapefruit scent I just think this one is probably my favorite from the ones that I've just barely picked up and I cannot wait to burn this oh it's gonna smell so good so the next and final candle in the summer category is Fiji white sands this is an iconic scent from Bath and Body Works they bring it back every summer and for many reasons it is the most amazing smelling candle I've ever smelled <laughs> that's dramatic but it's such a good scent it smells like coconuts and sandalwood and it just smells so good but the notes are cut sugarcane white nectarine sandalwood with essential oils and I don't really get nectarine all that much I definitely get like a coconut vibe to it that might be the sandalwood in it but it just smells like you're laying on the beach and you don't have a care in the world it literally just smells so good if you want like a signature summer scent in your home i definitely recommend fiji white sands it's amazing so that will conclude the summer category for candle scents next we're going to move into the fruity scents I love fruity candles that is my favorite category and candles I have a bunch of different ones and they're some of my holy grails so let's just get right into it so first in the fruity category we have sun wash citrus I think I might have one more use in this candle I have burned this to death and it just smells so good it's a very nice like clean citrus scent and this is another iconic Bath and Body Works scent that they bring back every summer and spring and the notes in Sunwash Citrus are Sorrento lemons, citron, agave nectar with essential oils. So you can imagine it just smells very lemony and clean, that signature lemon scent, like a kitchen lemon. But I love this scent, and again, I'm almost finished with it, so that tells you how much I enjoyed it, and I definitely recommend this. So I guess we'll just keep on going with the lemon-scented candles. Me and Josh love lemon candles or anything lemon. I have a bunch of different lemon scents in my collection because we enjoy it so much. But the next one is Sugared Lemonade, and this is another one that was limited edition and it just came out this year, but it smells amazing. You can imagine a sugared lemonade and what it smells like, and the notes in this are fresh lemon juice, sugar crystals, and crushed ice. I don't know what scent crushed ice is, but it has crushed ice in it. And this literally just smells like a very sweet lemon and it smells so dang good if you like the smell of lemons as much as I do I definitely recommend any of the lemon scented candles from Bath and Body Works they smell so good let's keep a toll of how many times I say it smells so good in this video because it's going to be like over a hundred next in the fruity category we have another lemon scent this is I think the last one I do have lemon cello but I don't know what pile I put it in it might be just like floating around here somewhere but I love the lemon cello scent from Bath and Body Works it's another iconic Bath & Body Works scent that they have but this next lemon scented candle in the fruity category is sugared lemon zest and it smells very similar to the sugared lemonade but me and Josh actually bought this candle last year so in 2020 and we absolutely loved it and then I saw it on Bath & Body Works page this year in 2021 and I had to repurchase it Sorry guys, my camera cut out because I was talking for so long already and we're not even halfway through the candles. So that's how this video is going. But I was talking about sugared lemon zest and how much me and Josh love this candle and I had to repurchase it again this year because we loved it so much last year. So the notes in this one are Sorrento lemons, cane sugar, lemon zest with essential oils. And it smells very similar to the sugared lemonade scent, but I just purchase any lemon scented candles from Bath and Body Works and I love them so much like every candle that I purchase that is lemon scented I have not disliked this one is again just like a sweet lemony scent and I just 
adore it. It smells so good and smells so clean and I don't think you will be disappointed. So next for the fruity category, we have Sunny Lime. And this one, again, is a very citrusy scent. It smells so good. I love this candle. And the notes in this one are squeezed lime juice, white peppercorn, bright bergamot with essential oils. And it just is very clean. It has like a different kind of spa scent to it. I think that's the bergamot in it. I really don't know much about scents and different like notes and things like bergamot and patchouli. I don't know very much about those different notes, but I do like, I think, the bergamot in this. It's very like spa scented. I don't know. I just really adore this candle. Me and Josh did burn this a bunch. I burned it about halfway and then we switched it out. But I definitely recommend this. It's a different scent. It's not as like sweet and very citrus forward as you would think. But I definitely, definitely love this candle and definitely recommend it. Next in the fruity category, I love this one in here, but it's called Ice Coconut Milk. And if you like coconut as much as me, I think you will love this candle. It's very subtle. It's not as like in your face as you would think. But the notes in this candle are coconut milk, crushed ice again, topped with sweet vanilla cream and essential oils. So it is like a sweet coconut scent, but again, it's not in your face coconut. It's very subtle, more like a coconut and vanilla scent. So if you can picture those two scents together, I'm sure you can imagine how amazing this candle smells and I for sure recommend it. And the packaging is just so cute. Like if you have any like blue notes in any rooms, I feel like it would tie together so cute. Like in a bathroom with like some blue notes, if you have blue in your bathroom or any room it would just look so cute so definitely recommend this candle sorry if you see me like leaning over a bunch all the candles are like laid out in front of me right now but next we have island margarita Ooh, getting spicy if you like a citrus scented candle you will love this again i love like a citrus lemony scent and this one is just that it smells honestly just like margarita mix and who doesn't love a good margarita mix and the notes in this candle are sweet mandarin, island mango, sea salt with essential oils. And I do get a touch of the mango in here, but it is more like a citrusy scent to me. And I absolutely love this. Next, we have Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. And this candle just smells so good. It smells like a tropical dream. And the notes in this candle are tropical passion fruit, radiant kiwi, juicy pineapple with essential oils. So if you like like a pineapple-y tropical like fruit punch scent, I think you will love this. It just smells like so clean and so nice and I love this candle and the packaging is so cute, so bright and I just love it. Moving on in the fruity category, we have fresh orange. So you can only imagine what this candle smells like. If you like orange, if you like that scent, you will love this. The notes in this candle are grated orange zest, sparkling citrus, white jasmine with essential oils. So. It is very orangey and it just smells like a like an orangey spa. Like you know the little essential oils that you'll put in like a diffuser. It smells like the orange scent. It just smells so good. I love this orange scent and I definitely recommend it if you like orange. So the next candle we have is Orange Pineapple Punch. So again, if you like orange, if you like pineapple, if you like that tropical scent, you are going to love this. And the packaging is just so dang cute. It's so fun and screams summer. I love it. But the notes on this candle are orange juice, sweet pineapples, vanilla sugar cane with essential oils. So if you like any of those scents, like an orange pineapple tropical scent, you are going to love this. It smells so good and I cannot wait to burn it. Mm. It's like such a summer scent. Moving on in the fruity category, we have banana cabana. I love banana. Me and my dad love anything banana scented, banana flavored. I just love bananas. So this candle has the notes of sun-kissed banana, sea spray, and warm vanilla. So if you like banana, I know it's a scent that is not well liked by everyone, but if you do like the scent of banana, I definitely recommend this because it smells so good and so sweet. Oh, I love it. It smells like Laffy Taffy, the banana Laffy Taffy. If you love that scent, I definitely recommend this candle because it smells just like that. And here we go. I found Lemon Cello. As I was talking about before, this is the other lemon scent that I love from Bath & Body Works. They have it all year round. It's one of their most iconic scents that they have. And it smells so good. It smells like Pez. Any of my 90s babies out there, if you know the scent of opening up fresh Pez, you know what that smells like. And that is exactly what this candle smells like, is Pez. So 
The notes in this candle are Sorrento lemons, cane sugar, lemon zest with essential oils. So again, if you do like the scent of lemons, I definitely recommend this candle. So back on the banana kick, the next candle in the fruity category is banana butt cake. And the notes in this candle are sweet banana, toasted walnuts with fresh cinnamon and essential oils. And this candle, honestly, it's more cinnamon forward than banana forward, but you do get that banana hit in the back of the notes of the candle. That was very backwards, but it is more cinnamon forward than banana forward. And honestly, it just smells like my grandma's banana bread in the kitchen when my grandma's making her banana bread. My cousins, you guys will know this scent. It's very nostalgic, and honestly, I love the smell of this. If you like the smell of like a sweet banana cake, you will love it. The smell of this candle next in the fruity category we have watermelon lemonade you can probably tell what this candle is going to smell like to me it smells like watermelon jolly rancher or the watermelon sour patch kids if you guys have ever had those but if you like the smell of watermelon that like fake watermelon smell you will love this the notes in this candle are watermelon ice sparkling water and meyer lemon so it smells just like a watermelon Jolly Rancher. So if you love that scent, I definitely recommend this candle. It's super fun for the summertime. So that was actually the last candle in the fruity category. And now we're going to move on to like the food scented category. And there is a lot. So let's just get cracking into the food scented category. First we have, this one kind of falls in the holiday category, but I just lumped it in this one because I feel like you could use it all year round if you wanted to, but it is sugared snickerdoodle. And if you love the smell of snickerdoodles, you are going to love this candle. It just smells like warm cookies and cinnamon. It smells so good. If you love, I know food scents are something that people either love or hate because it will make you hungry. And I honestly love the smell of them. I think they smell so good and sweet, so why not burn them? But the notes in this candle are warm spices, creamy vanilla, sugared musk, and essential oils. So this honestly just smells like fresh cinnamon baked cookies. And if you love that scent, you will love this candle. Moving on to our first miss in this candle collection. I really just don't like this candle. I ordered it online thinking that I would love it and it came in and me and Josh were like, ew. That was like the first candle we were like, oh my God, this is disgusting. But it is sugared pecan pie, which you would think it would smell so good and sweet, but it honestly, oh, it smells so bad. I can't even describe to you what it smells like. It almost smells like burnt crust like if you burnt something in the oven i don't know but the notes of this candle are gooey brown sugar filling toasted pecans homemade pie crust with essential oils so maybe it's the pie crust that i don't like i don't really know but i wouldn't recommend this candle i'm pretty sure it was limited edition and it won't be coming back again but who knows it might in the fall time but Definitely don't recommend this candle, it's disgusting. Moving on to a candle that I do like, this is Dutch apple pie, and it just smells like fall time. I absolutely love this candle. We burnt it like crazy in the fall slash winter time, and it just smells like apple pie to me. It smells so good. If you like the smell of apple pie, you will love this candle. The notes in this candle are warm buttermilk waffles, baked apple slices, ground nutmeg with essential oils. So. Again, if you like the smell of apple pie, you are going to love this candle. Moving right along, I just lumped this candle in this category because I felt like it could be in a bunch of different categories, but it is warm vanilla sugar. This is another like iconic scent from Bath & Body Works. I feel like they always have it and it's always like a reliable candle that will smell good. The notes in this candle are intoxicating vanilla, white orchid, sparkling sugar, fresh jasmine, creamy sandalwood with essential oils. So again, as this candle and the note said, it's an intoxicating vanilla. It smells so good and sweet. And if you just love the smell of vanilla, you're going to love this candle. It is a very reliable scent from Bath & Body Works and I definitely, definitely recommend. <sighs> okay, I need to start speeding through. I think we're at the halfway point right now, but this video is already like an hour long. So I just gotta get cracking with the scents. So next we have hot cocoa and cream. As you can imagine, it just smells like a very yummy chocolate warm like you just want to curl up with a nice book i mean normally the rain would make me want to stay at home curled up with a good book but everybody's being so nice to me today i'm really happy being here 
that's honestly what this candle reminds me of. It's just so sweet and chocolatey and smells amazing. The notes in this one are decadent milk chocolate, which I would agree, fresh steamed milk, mini marshmallows with essential oils. So if you love the smell of chocolate, you're going to love this candle. I like this candle, but I'm not in love with it. And it's called whipped coffee. It's more, I thought it was gonna be more coffee forward, but it has like a buttery undertone to it. I don't know. It's just not my favorite. So the notes in this coffee are a shot of espresso, whipped sweet cream, sugar crystal, with essential oils so if you like coffee you know you can get this one a shot but I'm just gonna let you know it's not my favorite I don't know if I would repurchase it I feel like Bath Body Works has had better coffee scents in the past so this one I feel like would be a pass for me moving right along me and my brother Anthony he has the same candle actually I was at his house in Connecticut and I was like oh my god I have the same candle and he was like it smells so good and I would have to agree this one is called wild berry jam donut it honestly just smells like a sweet jam and like baked goods. <laughs> like this is well as I can describe it, but it just smells so good and warm. And the notes in this candle are sweet wild jam, powdered donut, brown sugar crumble with essential oils. So if you like the like food scented candles and you like a sweet jam, I feel like you'll definitely love this candle. I 100% recommend. It smells amazing. Next, we have coconut cream pie. As I said before, I love the smell of anything coconut, and this is just like a very sweet coconut scent. I just, I think it smells amazing. If you don't like coconut, definitely pass on this candle, but if you like coconut, I would recommend. The notes in this candle are toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, golden pie crust with essential oils. So, very yummy and smells just like a coconut cream pie. Next we have vanilla and peach tea. So if you like the smell of peach and vanilla, that is exactly what this candle smells like. I don't really get any tea in it, but I definitely get the vanilla and the peach. Very peach forward, so if you don't like peach, definitely steer away from this candle. But the notes in this candle are peach tea, sweet vanilla cream with fresh oat milk. So if you like peach, I definitely recommend this candle. It smells amazing. Okay, going to try and speed through these candles, but next we have strawberry pound cake. The notes in this candle are fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, whipped cream with essential oils. So I love this candle and I definitely recommend if you like strawberries, it smells amazing. Moving right along, we have pineapple pancakes and the notes in this candle are fresh pineapple, fluffy pancakes, sweet banana slices brown sugar with essential oils and this one it honestly just smells like pineapple upside down cake which I love my aunt Martina makes the best pineapple upside down cake and if you like that scent you will love this candle it smells so good so the last two candles in the food category are passion fruit vanilla cupcake and the notes in this candle are fresh passion fruit, fluffy vanilla cake, white chocolate truffle with essential oils, and again, this smells very tropical and very like sweet like vanilla. It smells more vanilla-y than passion fruit-y, but it honestly smells so dang good, and I definitely recommend if you like a tropical vanilla scent. And the last candle in this category is berry waffle cone. The notes in this candle are sweet summer berries, golden waffle cone, creamy vanilla with essential oils. So you can only imagine what this candle smells like. Very sweet and fruity and everything you want in a candle. So I definitely recommend this if you like like a sweet berry scented candle, 100% recommend. <sighs> okay, so we're finally done with the food category. I had to reset my camera again because I was filming for so long. That was a never ending category, but now we can move on to, I think we're just gonna go into my fall scents. There is a lot in the fall scent category. A lot are repeats because I do like repurchasing a lot of their fall scents. So let's just get right into it. So first in the fall category, we are going to kick it off with Josh's sister's favorite scent. Jess, if you're watching this, I know you love Marshmallow Fireside, and that is the first candle in the fall category. This smells like, as you would expect, it smells very like bonfire-y, like you know that scent when you sit outside at a bonfire and then you come inside and your clothes smell like that bonfire scent. That is what this candle smells like. like so good, so nostalgic, and the notes in this candle are toasted marshmallow, smoldering woods, which I would agree, fire roasted vanilla, crystallized amber with essential oils, and this 
Oh, it just smells so good. I love the scent and I love burning it in the fall time. It's just one of my favorite fall scents from Bath and Body Works. And it is, again, one of their most iconic scents that they have during the fall and winter season. So I 100% recommend this candle. Moving right along, I'm pretty sure this candle was limited edition for last year in 2020. I don't know if they're going to bring it back for this fall in 2021, but I hope so because it smells amazing. One of my favorite candles that Bath and Body Works has come out with. And that scent is pumpkin. Pumpkin Dulce de Leche and the notes in this candle are warm spun caramel browned pumpkin butter golden crystal sugar with essential oils and it smells like a sweet sweet caramelly pumpkin if you love the smell of pumpkin and you love the smell of caramel I a million percent recommend this candle it smells so good I know pumpkin is one of those scents that people either love or they hate like my mom despises the scent of pumpkin but I love it so Definitely recommend this if you are a pumpkin lover. Speaking of pumpkin, the next scent in the fall category is pumpkin bonfire. And this is like a mix between a pumpkin candle and marshmallow fireside. The notes in this candle are white pumpkin, a bundle of clove buds, glowing embers with essential oils. And this just smells like, it smells like clove. I definitely get the clove scent in this candle, but it smells more of that like, again, that scent when you're out by a fire and then you come in and it smells like that. You know that scent. I can't really describe it unless you've experienced it, but you know the scent if you know what I'm talking about. And that's what this candle smells like with that pumpkin undertone. So again, if you love the smell of pumpkin, I definitely recommend this candle. Next is a scent that I repurchase every year from Bath & Body Works because I love it so much and it is leaves. I have three different like, canisters or candles in different packaging but these are all leaves and it's one of my favorite scents it smells so good and the notes in this candle are crisp red apple golden nectar warm clove spice with essential oils and if you love the smell of apples and like cinnamon and that like signature fall scent you know what I'm talking about like cinnamon and apples like duh that's so fall that is what this candle smells like. If you like the apple scent and that signature like clovey cinnamon scent with apples, I 100% recommend this candle. It smells so dang good and it's one of my favorite candles that Bath & Body Works comes out with. Next in the fall category is another duplicate. This category looked bigger than it was, but it was more of like I had like a bunch of different duplicates in this category. So the next scent in the fall category is flannel. I absolutely love flannel. These are the two different packagings that I have. It's just like a such a manly sense. That's how I would describe it. But the notes in this candle are fresh bergamot, heirloom, mahogany, soft musk with essential oils. So it honestly smells like cologne to me. Like a yummy manly cologne. I don't know. It just smells so good. I think it's the musk and the mahogany in it. I definitely recommend if you're not into like fruity or like baked goods or any of those scents, definitely recommend this candle because it smells so like manly and different and I love it. Speaking of mahogany, another iconic Bath & Body Works scent is mahogany teakwood and I just lump this into the fall category but I absolutely love this candle. Again, it smells like so manly and like a cologne, like a yummy manly cologne. And the notes in this candle are rich mahogany, black teak wood, dark oak, frosted lavender with essential oils. So again, it just smells like a very manly cologne. Like it smells like something my dad would wear as like a deodorant or like an ax spray. It just smells so good and I 100% recommend this candle if you like that like manly cologne scent. Okay, sorry if the angle of the camera changed but I had to change the battery because I was talking for so long and this video is going to be a million years long but the last two candles in the fall category are pumpkin pecan waffles. This just smells like a sweet pumpkin scent. And it's another signature scent that Bath & Body Works comes out with every year. And the notes in this candle are maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, brown sugar with essential oils. So again, just a very sweet pumpkin-y scent. And if you love the smell of pumpkin, you are going to love this candle. And last for the fall category, we have Sweater Weather. Another signature scent from Bath & Body Works that I purchase every single year, time and time again, and probably will forever. So the notes in this candle are fresh sage, juniper berry aromatic eucalyptus with fresh woods and essential oils so this again 
smells very like clean and manly and just a very different scent from the fruity and like food smells so if you're into like the clony scent again I would 100% recommend this candle so that will conclude the fall category for my candle collection and now we're going to move into holiday but before we do like Christmas holiday I'm going to do my other holiday candles I only have three and they're for Valentine's Day and Easter so let's just jump into those real quick and get them out of the way so for Valentine's Day I got this candle and I'm absolutely obsessed with the scent and the aesthetic of it I think it's just so cute but it's called be mine candy hearts and the notes in this candle are cotton candy sugar sparkling raspberries sprinkle of love from Cupid with essential oils like how cute is that but it just smells so sweet like sprinkles or a yummy cotton candy it just smells so good and I absolutely love the scent of this I wish I could burn it all year round but it's just perfect for Valentine's Day and I absolutely love it next we have my Easter candles first we have one that honestly smells very similar to that candy hearts candle for Valentine's Day but it's called tutti frutti jelly beans but the notes in this candle are sweet jelly beans mixed berries sugared lemon with essential oils and it honestly just smells like Fruit Loops, like that very fruity, lemony, ugh, smells like jelly beans. If you love the smell of jelly beans, that sweet, fruity scent, you're going to love this candle. And it's so cute for Easter, it has little bunnies all over it, like, how cute is that? And then lastly, for the, like, Easter Valentine's Day holiday, we have Marshmallow Fluff. But the notes in this candle are fluffy marshmallow, creamy vanilla, whipped sweet cream with essential oils. So it's just a very sweet candle and it's so cute, again, for Easter with little chicks all over it. I think that's such a cute touch. And the top of the Easter candles have this cute little bunny nose and whiskers. Like, that's so dang cute. Definitely recommend their, like, holiday collection candles because they're just, like, a nice touch and nice decor in the house for each holiday. All right, guys. Last and final category. We are in the home stretch for this candle collection. And the last category is holiday. Holy kisses. So the first candle in holiday is Tis the Season. This candle, Bath & Body Works, comes out with every year and I repurchase it every single time. It's just a signature Christmas scent to me. And the notes in this candle are red apple, sweet cinnamon, cedarwood. Very simple but smells so good. It just smells like holiday to me. It smells like Christmas. I just love the smell of this candle. If you love apples, if you love like a signature Christmas scent, this is the candle for you. And I just love how cute it is. It's so cute to have like as decor, that bright red. I love this color for holiday and one of my favorites for the Christmas season. Next in the holiday category for candles, I have Black Cherry Merlot. This candle might be around all year round, but I'm not sure. I just lugged it in the holiday category because the packaging, I'm pretty sure, was limited to the holiday season. But this is Black Cherry Merlot, and the notes in this candle are dark cherry, black raspberry, Merlot, and essential oils. So this smells very rich and if you love the smell of blackberries or like a fruity scent you're going to love this candle it's very like rich and more like mature than a fruity scent i love this candle and definitely recommend if you love like blackberries and cherry scented candles next in the holiday category we have welcome home this might be considered fall but i just put it in the holiday category and the notes of this candle are cinnamon sugar warm apple butter clove buds brown sugar with essential oils and this just smells like holiday and fall to me so sweet and cinnamony and it has all those spices that are associated with fall and winter so if you love the like fall scents you're going to love this candle it smells very cinnamony and spicy and apple-y so I love this candle definitely recommend moving right along we have holly jolly evergreen and you can imagine what it smells like it smells like a Christmas tree Oh, I love that smell. I love the smell of Christmas tree. I forget what it's called. I think it's just evergreen. But the scents of this candle are white fir needles, fresh cedar wood, sweet sap with essential oils. And I totally agree. Every year when we were younger, we would always go out and get a real tree for Christmas. But the past couple years, we just got a fake one. It's way easier. I definitely don't blame my family for getting a fake tree. Honestly, it's so easy. And these candles make it smell like 
you have a real tree so why the hassle of getting a real one and that's why I love these candles it's just nostalgic to me and then in that same category this candle smells honestly very identical but it's called fresh balsam and the notes in this candle are made with pine cedar wood and eucalyptus essential oils so again, it just smells like a Christmas tree and I definitely recommend these if you have a fake tree. If you want to burn them and make it seem like you have a real tree, I definitely recommend and very nostalgic. Love the smell of these candles. Okay, the last three candles in my collection. Holy moly, this has been a long video. Thanks for sticking around if you've made it this far. We've almost gone through 56 different candles and scents from Bath Body Works, but the last three candles we have are Sparkling Isopropyl. And this candle is so funny because it smells like my grandma Emmy's house in Long Island I don't know how to explain it. I don't know if my grandma has like a certain scent in her home But me and Josh both decided it smells like my grandma's house I really don't know why there's no rhyme or reason, but it's just very nostalgic to me I don't think I'll ever burn it just because of that reason and it just smells so good to me It smells like my grandma if I miss her. I'll just give this candle a smell it smells so good but the notes in this candle are glittering ice fresh bergamot sprigs bright holiday greenery with essential oils and I don't know what it is it just smells like my grandma's house I love it so definitely recommend this candle it smells so good and it's just very nostalgic for me so moving right along we have fresh fall morning so this probably should have been in with the fall category but whatever we're almost done so this candle has the notes of citrus zest woodland sage red delicious apples with essential oils and this just smells super fresh and clean I think the the woodland sage makes it smell more fresh than apple-y and it smells like again like a manly cologne to me i don't know i love the smell of this candle and definitely recommend it and last but not least we have frozen lake this candle is very cool looking it's like holographic kind of i don't know if you guys can see it's like t green but blue i don't know it's very cool packaging and the notes in this candle are lavender leaves cool eucalyptus juniper berries with essential oils and this one again it smells just so clean it's like a very clean scent kind of manly I don't know I love this candle I think it's so different and if you like the smell of like a clean room I don't know it just smells clean and like a manly cologne to me so definitely recommend that if you're looking for a different scent holy moly you guys I cannot believe we just went through 56 different candles from Bath and Body Works that is my entire collection and that is not everything like I've burned and gone through a bunch of different candles I have so many other favorites I can't think of right now because my brain's mush from going through all those candles but I absolutely love Bath and Body Works I recommend any of their candles as you can see I only had like two or three misses in this entire collection which speaks volume for Bath and Body Works candles and their scents like I I feel like mostly all of their scents smell amazing there's something for everyone and I definitely recommend their candles I will repurchase them time and time again I just love them I feel like they last a very long time they're super intense but not too intense where they give you a headache so please leave a comment down below what your favorite candle scent was and what is your favorite scent from Bath and Body Works so thank you guys so much for watching if you made it to the end of this video like kudos to you you guys are amazing and definitely give this video a, a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe down below so you do not miss another video from me thank you guys so much for the growth in this channel I'm so proud of it I cannot believe I'm at 500 subscribers I literally never thought that I would get past 100 but here we are at 500 and I'm so proud and cannot wait to see this channel grow so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye guys and I'm so proud and cannot wait to see this candle, candle. <laughs>